Hey friends and welcome back. I don't know if you've seen, but in my last couple of vlogs, I've done a bunch of thrifting and so I wanted to share with you guys a few looks that are using all the pieces from the thrift store because sustainability is a really important thing for me when it comes to fashion. I'm not like hard and fast about like you have to be 100% sustainable all the time, but I really do think that shopping at the thrift store is just a huge blessing if you can do it or shopping secondhand. So it's a big part of like my particular fashion like philosophy. So definitely subscribe to the channel if you're into sustainable fashion, ethical fashion, and thrifted fashion. Also, if you love French girl style, that is a huge component of what my taste is about. But as we'll talk a little bit uh, in this video, there are some new style influences that are coming in and weaving their way into my style journey of late, and I can't wait to share those with you. And of course, if you love sustainable style, and if you are looking to kind of enhance your style through simple means, I think that jewelry is one of those things that you can easily add to any outfit to make yourself feel just like refreshed and fancy without having to try too hard. So today's video is actually in collaboration with and sponsored by Ana Luisa and I'm so excited to be sharing them with you again. This is my fourth collaboration with them and the reason why I love working with them is because they are so committed to sustainable and ethical manufacturing practices. All of their jewelry is just really high quality. They use recycled gold and silver, nothing but the purest noble metals, and they really are focused on giving back. What I mean by that is that they actually care about offsetting 100% of their carbon emissions and the way that they do that is by sourcing their materials as raw materials from recycled metals and then even all the way up into disposing of their pieces should that time come. You get really fine jewelry but you're not paying for luxury markups because everything on the website literally starts at $39, at which I think anyone can invest in a piece like that. But aside from them being like an ethical and sustainable company, I also really love them because they're super fashion forward while still being extremely classic. And as I've acquired more and more pieces from Ana Luisa and I've paired these pieces over the years together, I can see that they all work really well, even though they might be slightly different styles. I just think they're really chic and they're items that I know I'm gonna be wearing for 10, 20, 30 more plus years, and I just absolutely love this company. I really, really, really love pairing my pieces with my thrifted and sustainable outfits. I feel like it's a great way to like bring up a thrifted piece of clothing, even if it's designer, to like elevate it slightly is to put on some really beautiful jewelry. So all the pieces of jewelry that I'm wearing except for my wedding rings are from Ana Luisa, from previous collaborations or just from this video. And I love that you can stack these pieces together, you can like create a layered look and it just works because they're simple and elegant and classic. So if you guys want to grab 10% off of your purchase, you can use the code BriannaL10 and everything will be linked in the description box, including the pieces that I'm wearing and I'm really excited for you guys to check them out. Don't forget to head to that description box so all the links and all of the codes will be there for you. Spring's right around the corner and I have been really inspired lately by a few you ladies that I'm following on Instagram and as the season starts to change and the sun is coming out more and I'm more you know driven and motivated to get outside and like enjoy the weather and enjoy the sun I have been inspired by changing up my color palette a little bit and going towards a slightly more muted look. The fun thing about fashion is that you can just play. You don't have to feel like you're stuck in a box all the time. I know that you guys saw in some of my previous vlogs that I had passed up this really beautiful bright red Fair Isle sweater and I was thinking about that and how it's so important to let things go even if they're so good and so cool because it will open up more space in your life uh, for pieces that you really, really love. And I did love that piece and a part of me really regrets not getting it, but as you'll see in the video, there are some other items that I just feel 
are really kind of where I'm trying to go with my style. So I'm thinking more neutral colors, I'm thinking more like just classic pieces that are within like cream, black, kind of gold possibly with little hints of blue and beige and just sort of like creamy warm colors you know not so much bright but just like creamy but i kind of want to go for a more sophisticated look and so the thrift store is a great way to do that i am denim girl all the way it's super hard for me to not wear denim and I would love to get some piece, some pants, some bottoms that aren't denim. I'm really into knitwear right now. I'm really into blouses, maybe some like flowy blouses, some striped oversized blouses, and then obviously I have an outerwear addiction, which you will see here in a second. Of course, French girl style is 100% an influence in my life and that's probably never, ever, ever going to go away. I do believe that the blaze and the outerwear pieces some of them are more typical French girl while some of them tend I would say to lean more towards a like a Spanish or maybe more just not so kitschy or cliche but a little bit more chic and elevated I really also want to just give a huge shout out to one of my besties in the whole wide world Kate Spears who found for my birthday these incredible Chanel mules at the thrift store for $11. If you're someone who's just like really kind of on the fence about thrifting, I say get off the fence because you just never know what you can find. You can find the coolest stuff. And if you're really committed to sustainable style, then the thrift store to me is one of the very best options. My mom and I were actually talking about how there is no shortage of clothing and we live in a city that is less than a million people and we probably have gosh I don't know 30 plus thrift stores it's always packed it's always packed full of clothes and full of things and so if you're looking for something I promise you you can find it you just have to keep going and keep checking it out I know that I'm a little bit boring by kind of sticking to the jeans look but to me it's the most flexible piece in my wardrobe and it's something that I love to build outfits around. I am really going to try to get some different kinds of pants but you can see that just with the jeans and all these different sweaters and tops, you know, just a couple pairs of shoes and one handbag, you've really got, um, you know, you're, you, you, you have so many options, like you have so many cool things to choose from. I've definitely stolen some of my husband's pieces for these looks, like the Oscar de la Renta sweater that I got for him. It's just so cozy and so chic. I'm really wanting to be very comfortable these days. I don't want to feel uncomfortable in my clothes and I really love that kind of an oversized, more casual vibe is coming back. And I do believe that for this next season i think that we're gonna start seeing a lot of a lot of comfort wear coming into fashion but still being elevated with that being said i think that there's a way to do it and a way to wear it to wear you look cute and you look put together but you're not feeling so buttoned up so structured all the time but i do i do still love a classic cut i do still love having fitted pieces and i think that you know you just can't go wrong with that if you're at home and you're just, you know, doing your own work and you're just hanging out at home, what's to say that you can't just throw on a pair of jeans, a comfortable pair of ballet flats, and a nice oversized sweater, and that just does the job for you? But likewise, you can easily put a t-shirt and a blazer on, a same pair of comfortable flats, and you're good to go. Honestly, fashion doesn't have to be that complicated. I, I think that going to the thrift store and shopping there for sustainable sustainably sourced pieces is a great way to dip your toe in the water of any kind of fashion trend kind of like with what I'm wearing right now this is so not something that I might typically go for but it's so on trend at the moment and it was very affordable so it's a great way for me to try it out and see how I feel in it and to see how other people respond to it then I can always throw it up for sale on Poshmark or Depop or something like that if I just absolutely hate it in the end. I really am excited about where fashion is going in 2021 and I think that we're gonna see kind of a lot of, I'm gonna call it collegiate preppy 
that kind of vibe where you're gonna see a lot of oxfords, loafers, uh, brogues if you want to call them that. You'll see sweaters, sweater vests, striped tube socks, formal college gear, whether that's the University of Paris or the Sorbonne or Yale or Harvard or anything like that. I think we're gonna see a lot of argyle and a lot of tweed <laughs> as we have already been seeing, but I'm excited to kind of put some of those pieces into my wardrobe and play with those a little bit. Everything is in style still, so there's you can't really you can't really wear something that's out of style per se, but I think it's all about how you wear it and how comfortable you feel in it. All right, you guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you found that kind of thrift store haul, that sustainable fashion haul really inspiring. I would love to hear in the comments section below like what your take on the upcoming fashion trends are or kind of what your favorite pieces were from the thrift store that you saw me get. And again, a huge thank you to Anna Luisa for sponsoring today's video. Don't forget that you guys can get 10% off of your purchase by using the code BriannaL10. All the links and all the pieces will be in the description box below so you can go and check out those items for yourself and start building your own sustainable jewelry collection along with your sustainable fashion collection and start elevating your thrift store pieces by investing in some really beautiful jewelry. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys next week. Take care, bye.